If you're an athlete and you're dealing with an injury and you want to know something you can do to help you be a better athlete while you are injured and can't physically perform your sport and to be able to come back a lot more smoother and a lot more effectively than you otherwise would after the injury, this video is for you. Hi, my name is Kate Algren. I'm the owner of Quantum Performance, a high performance coaching firm that specializes in the mental training of athletes, both youth and elite level alike. One of the biggest things that an athlete who is injured can do to help themselves is to visualize, to use the power of imagery to help them become a better athlete while they are injured and get those mental reps in, as well as make it so that when they actually are able to physically get back into their sport, they have a little bit more of a smoother transition than they might otherwise be doing. Imagery is such a powerful thing because our brain does not know the difference between what we experience and what we think or see in our mind. A lot of the time when I work with an athlete, one of the hardest things for them is because they're so used to doing things, um, setting goals, achieving goals, being active, it can be very hard to almost kind of feel like you don't have control over what you are doing or feel like you're not getting better as an athlete. And imagery, even when you're not injured, is such a powerful tool. But especially while you're injured, you have that extra time. You have that extra time that where you can do more mental reps. You can visualize what you would be doing in practice, visualizing your performances. This is a key for when you are injured. So really think about adding visualization into your daily routine if you are injured. It's really going to help you not only be a better athlete long term, but also help you kind of mentally deal with the injury recovery process as it is. Any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. Again, Kate Allgood with Quantum Performance.